Alright, what's up guys? We're back on the gameplay of the commentary too. Today Today we have got a sniping gameplay. 17 and 3 sniping Baraka or something like that. I don't know. It's it's I do a couple hard scopes. Okay guys, no, don't don't make fun of me, but I'm not that great at sniping right now. Doing actually pretty bad with it. But anyways, um So today I'm gonna be talking about an optic midnight. She said something about this, so I figured I'd uh Build onto oh that was a nice quick scope. I, I'll give myself credit for that one. And then I got killed by this kid with assassin. Anyways, um she talked about like life on another planet. And she has this whole like honestly an amazing commentary about what she, how she believes in it and everything. And how they scientists have actually found another uh planet that looks exactly like Earth. It has the same aspects as Earth. It's not the uh, same size, but it's in an inhabitable zone where, like, the sun is the right distance away. The sun, it's honestly in a perfect world. It's like, they, there's clouds there, like, can, uh, can, I'm from Canada, I don't know why I just said Canada. But it's got clouds, it's got everything that a planet would need. And that's my last death. A planet would need to survive. It has, and it would. It we won't be able to go there because it takes 22 million years or something for a ship to go there. Because it's like I forget how many millions or thousands of light years away, and it's just it's insane. But that's just how it is. I, I wish we could go there, like. I think like finding life on another planet would be like such a, a mind-blowing breakthrough and it would defy all religious aspects in the world because what it shows is God created the planet the universe and etc 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 crap like that no, not crap I'm not trying to offend you guys or anything but I'm just saying like all that stuff and then um, it does not say ever ever in the Bible or I, f I forget like I only know the Bible because that's like our uh, town's religion it's pretty much like I don't know but oh uh, I forgot what I was gonna get it uh, but it doesn't never says in one single page in any of those books that there's another life on another planet so if there's another life on another planet, that means our religions are all wrong. Which would change the way we would look at things and change the way we see things and everything, honestly everything would change. Because, like if the people who are hardcore religious would, I seem to be talking about a lot of religion when we get into this. And it would just, it would just destroy everything and there I got perfectionist <laughs> yeah buddy um and it would destroy everything that we ever thought of of a religion because where does it say there's life on another planet if it proves that there's life on another planet well hey look at that how can you say that religion is right then no one will say that the religion is right because it's impossible to say your religion is right when there's physical evidence and proof that it ex doesn't exist. That there exists at this life on another planet. But like, I would show you guys this, but I'm honestly a little bit too lazy to edit it. Because it's like, it's only 8.30, but still, I don't feel like, um, I don't feel like doing much today. I don't think I'm just gonna sit down and play some Call of Duty after this commentary. Because, like, there's not much I can do. I don't have school homework or nothing. And then it, it, it's really cool. I'll put the link down to her uh, her video of it with the uh, it'll, it'll show us like the the look of our universe and then a brain cell. It is almost identical. It's almost it's almost scary how identical it looks because they, it has like all the little aspects around it. it has lots of things that would make us want to believe that like she made this point what if we're 
What if your brain cell is another universe? And there's millions of brain cells in all of our universe. And all of our... There's millions, maybe billions of brain cells. And this guy gets a nice, nice, nice claw. And it is pretty slick. And it's honestly mind-blowing. You guys look out for yourself. I, I'm, I'm not really good at explaining this topic, but... Anyway, 17-3. Peace out, guys. Do what you guys do. Have a good day and chill the fuck out.